Hey, Kim. Hey. Where are we going today? Going to the amusement park. Look, it's right behind us, actually. Yes, it is. So we're going to Sky World's amusement park. And uh, we'll both be doing a video because we'll both have different things to share today. So make sure you check out Kim's channel at Kimberly Sandbox. But Sky World's amusement park at Resort Worlds in Genting Highlands. It's awesome. Looking forward to it and sharing our day with you. Look, she's just like a little kid at an amusement park. So you can get your tickets over there. So we bought our tickets online for 98 ringgit each, which is about $22. So when you come up here, if you want to do this, just buy your tickets online. I've got a barcode. I'm thinking we can go right over to the entrance over there and uh, we'll see how it goes. So coming in went pretty easy. We had our barcodes that we got offline online and you scan your barcode, it turns green and then we got to give them our fingerprint. My guess is the fingerprints for multi-day access or multi-access during the day. So all good so far. I don't expect there to be much of a crowd here. What do you think, Kim? So let's go to Andromeda Base first, Kim. Alpha fighter pilots first. What did you think, Kim? So, Kim, oh, what did you think of Alpha Alpha <laughs> Fighter Pilots? Holy shit. You, we didn't see anybody on it before we got there, did we? Oh, so, was it a little unexpected? A surprise. All right. Yeah, yeah. They've got a uh, wait times posted throughout the park on all the different rides. Plus, they have the shows that are happening today. So they got shows at various times throughout the day and all the wait times, which are all essentially zero right now.
we're going on next. I don't know the name of it, but it's the Sky Blaster type thing. So the Terraform Tower Challenge. So I wasn't able to get that on video, so you won't be able to see how awesome it was. But it was that tower right there. It was pretty good. I've got this camera right here that secures to my shirt like that. They spotted it and they wouldn't let me bring it. Yeah. Let's go here. Invasion of the Planet of the Apes. Where are we going, Kim? To the Planet of the Apes. Invasion of the Planet of the Apes? Yeah. So that ride's temporarily closed. They said they will open today. So let's go to Independence Day. Defiance. The line was super fast. Okay, now since most of you are first time here from now on, call yourselves recruits. Recruits, before you start on your mission, I will give you first a very short briefing. The development of Star Tower's wormhole generator allows research and defense teams to travel at faster than light speed to anywhere in the galaxy. Global Defender. That's what we're going on next. A little bit to learn. That ride has a sign that says VQ reservation is mandatory for that ride, and we didn't do anything about that with that. So we gotta learn about what they're talking about. here see if this is open oh night at the museum isn't open yet but again he says they will open a little bit later so I don't know what that means we'll figure that out
you just say? <laughs> I'm sliding all over the place in that little seat. Were Back you there. were you actually scared? No, I just I just thought it was hysterical. I <laughs> third ride that we're trying to get into that isn't open right now, so I'm not sure what that's all about. But no, this looks open though. Acorn Adventure. Alright. It's only $22 to get in here, but so far, three rides aren't open that we tried to go on. And now, we actually have to go put stuff in a locker because they don't have lockers at this ride, but every other ride has lockers, so yeah, I'm not yeah. sure. It's still fun. Yeah. So let's try to go on Sid's Rock and Slide. Open? <laughs> because we can't seem to find a locker, Kim's gonna go on Acorn Adventure by herself. I'm gonna watch the bag. See you later, Kim. How was it, Kim? It was good. You'll need to go on it. Acorn Adventure. Hold on. All right. I'm, like, what am I gonna do? Not hold on and fly out of the <laughs> cart? It was good. Yeah. All right. I'll see you in a bit. Okay. Now it's my turn to go on Acorn Adventures. So that ride was Acorn Adventure. It's a roller coaster. It was worth it. So if you come here, you want to go on Acorn Adventure. It's a lot of fun. Although Kim and I couldn't go on it at the same time because they make you check your bag in a locker. They don't just give you a place to store it. So a little bit different on this ride, but definitely worth going on. Epic voyage to Moonhaven. decided to pass on Epic Voyage to Moonhaven because they suggest raincoats. And I don't feel like buying a raincoat. But there are hummingbird flyers over here. I don't know what those are. We saved the day. We did. You are flower. And we saved the day. That's what they said. So let's see if Night at the Museum is open now. It wasn't open earlier. It looks like it's open now, though. I think it's not here, shoot.
So we're in the Invasion of the Planet of the Apes. It was closed earlier, but it's open now. Okay, very good, thank you. Everything we need to do destroyed. San Francisco isn't safe anymore. Fellow survivors. The virus made them smarter. They began to learn and speak. And they found a leader. Caesar. And help me search the warehouses. Tell Caesar to get out before the invasion begins. Knock them out. have a visual on you. Stay sharp and hurry. Those soldiers could be anywhere. We think we saw Caesar head into the warehouse. We have to find him before the Alphas do. Keep quiet. Any sign of Caesar? Shh, quiet. Humans, betrayed, apes, apes, so mercy. Now you're here to finish us off. Good, the Planet of the Apes. Yeah, that's cool. uh, it was in 3D, so I'm not sure how it showed up in video, but again, if you're here, it's worth going to. That was fun. That was fun? Yeah, yeah, it was cool. So we're about done. I'm a little more done than Kim. But I'm done, so we're done. We went on just about everything. A few of the rides were closed early on, but they did open. And then there was the whole issue with the locker. So if you're ever gonna come here, I would suggest just getting a locker when you first get here. It's 20 ringgit, so it's like $5, but it's good for the whole day.